Moving on to Kindness Day, it's still taking place here at News Channel 8 for about another half hour. Yeah, now is your chance to help out any or all of the five organizations on hand today. And joining us live from our parking lot on South Parker Street in downtown Tampa is eight on your side's Brianda Viegas to tell us more how you can donate. Hi, Brianda. Hey everybody, so we have been having such a blast out here. I'm here with Captain Fear. We have the Bucks cheerleaders encouraging people to stop on by Kindness Day. It's one of the most exciting events. Hundreds of people have already stopped by. And what you can do, you can donate toys. And let's talk a little bit more about how this will impact the community. So I'm here with Sergeant Bird and Staff Sergeant. Uh, well, tell us a little bit more about what kind of toys people can bring. So tell us, like, what kind of things have you been seeing around here? So we've been seeing some of the Big Tech toys for the girls who've been seeing makeup kits, purses, uh, some jewelry come in. For the younger children, they have the, the learning toys, leapfrog, and bikes. Bikes is the big, the big hot commodity for this a lot campaign. Of bikes this year. A lot of bikes this year. And I mean, you all have seen like how the kids are just smiling and you've seen something really special too with other kids coming up. Of course. So a lot of the kids this year have saved up their own money, saved up their own toys to donate. And I feel like that's a really special place. So how does this make you feel to be a part of Kindness Day? Because y'all have been coming with us for so long. Oh, it's a, it's kind of magical, what you, <laughs> you want to say. Because <laughs> um, like I came in, and I was working in a warehouse earlier and they was like, all right, come out. And some toys, and I was like, where are all these toys coming from? It's Connors Day. So we had to send two trucks to go pick up toys. Yes, ma'am. That is awesome. It just really shows like how much our viewers have really, really stepped up. And let me show you around, my friend. So back here, we also have the Rough Riders. They are looking for fluffy, cute teddy bears for you all to donate. They have to be new. Back there is Feeding Tampa Bay. There's a great need for meals in our community we need non-perishable food items so if we take a look back here as well we have the hillsboro education foundation they are actually such a great organization that really help kids in need from title one schools you can stop by donate school supplies scissors notebooks pens paper anything that you can think can really help out those kids and we also have one blood out here you can donate blood i was out here with amanda holly earlier and right after our live hits she was able to hop on there and donate some blood it's something that you know doesn't take that much time but it really does make a big big difference here for everyone in our community for now i'll send it back to you guys all right brianda thank you so much 